after that 2008 Olympics is when the picture. Oh, that's the second one came out. Yeah, yeah that's <laughs> that's when the picture of you and the bong yeah. hit yeah. the world. A couple things happened with with the bong picture to me. First of all, what really doesn't sit well with me is that there was a real hardcore violation of you and what you were doing sure. in your private time. Yeah. For whatever mistake you made, I would more blame the person and think the person's lower on the totem pole for turning that picture in. And from what I know from talking to people close to you, you know who that person is. There were, there were six people in that house. And one person that I didn't really know is the one. I know who it is. I know his name. What can I do? I was told that you were told by your lawyer, I can make that person's life a living hell. And you said no. That kid's got to look at himself in the mirror every day. And, you know, I mean, karma's a bitch. You know? And, and you know, it's like, you know, for me, for me, it's like, yeah, it's, yeah, I, I messed up. And, and I made a choice to do that. Nobody twisted my arm or did anything or this and that. I, I put myself in that position. And somebody took a picture. There's, I mean, you know, and, and, you know, the thing for me, it's like, I understand, you know, for me doing what I've done, I've essentially written away privacy, you know. There are certain places where I can be, where I can be left alone, and you know that's why my fiance, my, my my fiance and I, we're homebodies, because we want to be left alone. You know, we want to be able to to sit and watch a movie and not have anybody, you know, jump in or here or there. You know, for like, I mean, this morning, like, we went out to a restaurant, and after I ate, people came up and asked for a picture. That's no problem. But while I'm eating, I want to be left alone. You know, so there are certain things in my life that I always have to do. And, and, and that's one thing that when, when we're out in public that we make sure that if we're eating, we're eating and we're engaged with one another. Um, or, or, you know, like I said, I don't, I don't leave my house very often. I, I just want to be... Isn't that a shame, though? It is, but, it, it, you, know, it's, it, you know, like I said, it's a way of life nowadays. It's, it's, what, it's what this world is. You know, it's like, you know, sometimes, yeah, it'd be cool to, you know, we do go to movies from time to time, but whatever. I mean, I go to El Dorado and play golf, you know. <laughs> you, know? Right. you know, I get away. I, I, there, there are certain places that we go where we can be left alone and, and you know, we can be normal people because that's, that's what I am. I'm a, I'm a normal person. I'm a normal person who... Except for this thing. <laughs> But I'm a normal person just like everybody else in here. I, I, I happen to, to be good at swimming, and, and I found it at a young age, and I became very passionate about it, and I just chased my goals. That's really it. And sure, that got me to where I am, and you know, it's great, but I'm just like you guys. You know, I like to sleep. I like to go and have a nice meal. I like to watch a movie. Like, I like to eat candy, like whatever, like whatever it is. Like, I'm, I'm normal, you know? Like, and, and I look at myself that way, it's just, I just found something that, that I guess I'm decent at.